Hi there! So I'm flying to India for the very first time ever and I am super excited. I've actually never done anything this far solo before. So I just checked in. This is my room. God, it's so beautiful. This is so beautiful. Love the vibe. I've always wanted to visit India, but I never really had the chance and I didn't want to do the solo. So when Priya, my friend, invited me to her wedding, I got so excited. I'd love to attend her wedding and I also want to see India. So it's like a win-win. So after the wedding, we're going to go around the country, mostly Rajasthan and then Agra to see Taj Mahal and finally Delhi. So that's the plan. And this is me attending my friend's wedding, my very first Indian wedding and also my first time in India. It's probably one of the prettiest hotels ever. It feels like I'm in a palace. I like it. I like it so much here. It's actually a guest house. It's not really a hotel. doors, all the historical art on the wall, the tiny little corners like these, I've got more here, <laughs> I love them, and the bed, and there's this weird elevation, like this floor is flat, then it goes up like a platform, and then the third level is here where I'm sitting, so cute, these small little windows, look at them. This is exactly what I was looking for. I didn't want to go for a hotel because I really don't need to. I wanted something that feels more organic, natural, like the everyday Indian house. I was looking for something more traditional, something very Indian, you know, in the middle of the city, very organic, something local. This is a family home, a family business. It's a husband and wife that own this building and it's 300 years old, which is amazing. This place looks really nice at night. Very cozy. You won't believe what I found here. I was shocked when I found an Italian book. This is weird. Like the, the most random combination of books, you know? New Moon. Oh my god, New Moon. I read this book. I d oh my god, I read this book in high school. The people are singing outdoors. I don't know what's going on. It seems like a concert or something. And I woke up because it's very loud. Good morning, morning. My first night in India. <laughs> okay. So it's day two in Jodhpur and this is my new room. I'm gonna be sleeping here for two nights with two girls, Priya's friends, because we were all attending her wedding at this venue downstairs and they gave us this room. They basically divided all the rooms in this building for her friends and family and most of us were couples except for me and two other girls so we're sharing this I'm sorry about the mess, just ignore the background <laughs> This is lunch. Some curry. I'm not sure what's the name of this. And soup. Both spicy. Sweets, very nutty sweets. Paratha. <laughs> <laughs> and I like this mirror. The 
this is my second outfit. I'm wearing this under my sari. I have no idea how to wear a sari, so I'm gonna have to google it and see how to wrap it around my body. I know the background looks crazy, but ignore that. So this is what I'm gonna be wearing underneath my sari. A crop top and a skirt. My sari. I've got the blouse as well, this is the original blouse original top that comes with the sari but it's not stitched and I didn't have time to stitch this so I'm gonna be wearing this one which is my like a normal crop top I like the shoulders I still like this one it has golden patterns so pretty sorry you're gonna have to watch a YouTube video So stunning and very happy and I really really enjoyed this wedding. So this is where the tour begins. We're exploring Rajasthan and this is Jodhpur. We are going to the Mehranga fort which is where the Maharaja used to live and I really love how elevated this fort is. It's actually built in the mountains and you get an amazing view of the city as well from the top and the rooms are gorgeous. They choose the color of God Shiva and Krishna indigo. So they recognize there's the house of the Brahmin community. That's the area is called Brahmapuri. Second name, Jodhpur is very hot in the summertime, like 40, 45, last going to 50 degrees. So when they paint the blue color, it makes cool and give us light. Third reason is that mosquito ants, they hate the blue color. So Jodhpur calls the blue city. This fort is a 565 year old fort, well maintained, well preserved, well clean. And a hole in the Rajasthan, number one, well maintained fort because of hope. First of all, we thanks for whole tourists for coming. Because this fort is the not government. This fort is the Mehrangad Museum Non-Profitable Trust. Every fort has the one thing is saying. They have the two parts, men's and the ladies. So we start from the men and ending from the ladies fort here, which is the oldest part of the group. When the king is dying, the sun is next week. Ladies are standing in that area. That's called Chantima. So ladies can look at everybody, but nobody look to ladies. Second, when you see from the far, it's like a wood, but it's not wood. This is a sandstone. This is a local stone of wood. How long did it take to build? But it's more than 300 years. Yeah. More than 300 years. Yeah. Because the sword is a whole bit mounted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You cut, carving, fix. Cut. I don't how long they were. Can you see this in the paper? The white, all the white paper. And here, the detail of that, what they have worried, what they have inside. Look at that.
one yeah. dude though. Why is there only the Maharaja and then Maybe there's a harem. Look, look, look. It's a boob. It's a boob. It's a boob. Where? It is a boob. Over here. A boob. It's a boob. Oh my god. It looks like this in the Karma Sutra. <laughs> under, you never know what's happening under those skirts. The dancing hall. Yeah. They have the beautiful paintings of the body of the Mahamahajas. They have the down, like in small, small paintings. They are 36 melody of the ragas, the classical music of India. Uh -huh. You know, you say the Dore Mipa solo. Like the song. Dore Mipa solo. Oh, yes. yeah. We say the Sarawai Dharma, so we have the 36 melody of the Rana, strike of the eagle, that's the flight of a king. So that's where the Mahabharata's best is coming from there. And this is the Hanjali Mahabharata. Yes, George? Yeah, John's brother. What? John's brother, you know? No, married where? Married where? In that, that, that building over there? In the fog, in the fog, I can barely see it. The last one. Go, bamboo, 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 bamboo,